Okay, um, for those who know me, you know that I love Harry Potter, and I, th I think it's, it's a wonderful movie, it's a wonderful book, and, um, but I've, I've noticed some things in the movies that I would think that, according to the, to the pagan and Wiccan community, would like to know. I don't know if you guys noticed this or not, but I've, I've noticed it, being an astrologer and everything. As you can tell, I got all, so far, all five movies of Harry Potter. I even have the poster. I don't know if you can see it up there, but yeah. The first movie was Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone. Now this vi this movie right here talks. I've noticed that th she mentions or they mention um, the Earth element. Okay, the the Sorcerer's Stone is actually the Philosopher's Stone because um, Flamel was in, was mentioned in this movie, which I thought was cool, but. Um, it, it talked about all the earth signs, Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn. And it talked about wealth. Um, Harry Potter found out that he had a lot of money by his parents. Um, they, they mentioned a bank of, uh, <laughs> I forget the name of the place, but they mentioned the banks. Uh, Taurus is known to be the bankers of the Zodiac. Um, Virgo, uh, like getting ready to of education, getting ready to learn, getting your your things together, your supplies, and Capricorn, which is like um, getting getting to business. It, it mentioned all the Earth signs. On the second one, let's see which one was the second one. Okay, here we go. The second one was this, the Chamber of Secrets. This one right here. Hang on, can you see it? I don't know if the camera could take it. But this one is talking about the element of water, which also mentioned the, the Cancer, Scorpio, and Pisces. Um, it mentions the highly emotional parts of the characters and um well it, it talks about the home the the um it talks about the wizard's home in a little bit it mentions that that's the, under the sign of cancer um secrets looking deep within like scorpio and um Pisces is dealing with like dreams or memories or the past so it's about the element of water the next one is um, <coughs> the prisoner of Azkaban this one right here no let me show you like this is the prisoner of Azkaban and um, on this one it talks about the element of air um, it also mentions the signs of Gemini, which they emphasize on the twins, the two uh, twin wizards, um, and their their sneakiness, you know, and uh, having to go out on your own, and um, not to mention this flying creature in the back. You see that? I think it's called a griffin. Yeah, griffin, and. Um, it, it talks about Libra, meaning, you know, the balance and stuff. I mean, I'm sure it talks about some kind of balance. And Aquarius being the sign of friendship. And that's, that's you know, learning about your friends and who your friends really are as opposed to who your f enemies are. Now, on the fourth one is the Goblet of Fire. Obviously, this is the element of fire. And on this one, it talks about... The challenges and the sport likes and everything related to Aries and Leos and Sagittarius. Um, having to have different schools from different places to come in, which is like far distant traveling that's related to Sagittarius. Um, being the center of attention, Leo, and um, 
Aries, of course, uh, challenges and starting things that are new and, uh, and stuff like that. On the fifth one, the Order of the Phoenix. Now, in this movie, they talked about all four elements, especially when um, the bad guy and um, Harry Potter, uh, Dumbledore, I'm sorry, Dumbledore and, um, who's that bad guy? I forgot his name. But, um, they were playing, they were fighting each other with the, the elements. The first element they, uh, was, um, fire, which was cast by the bad guy. And then Dumbledore cast the element of water. And, um, let's see when the glass broke and everything and turned into dust you know that's that's the element of earth if you listen real closely the bad guy said earth and then um, after that he said air which when he turned into the air and got inside Harry Potter's head it's just that's just something you know I mean I could go into details and I probably will but that's what I've in a, in a you know A short version, I guess. So, tell me what you guys think. Thanks.